giving you a voice, and making it loud our own way. Welcome, Welcome to, to the fun. fun. All right, we're going to keep moving on with that said. So on to number 26. And our 2016 is going to be team number 467, the Colonials. Let's see how I do on the pronunciation here. They're from uh, Shrewsbury, Massachusetts. Yep. Perfect. Uh, 10, 19, and 0 this year in official play. And coming out with $6. 7, the TCG. $8 to the Quran Fan Club. And sold for $8. Quran takes her 13. Quran Fan Club takes her 13, I should say. Uh, and still has $161 left. Next team, 6328. That's a mechanical advantage. 6328 mechanical advantage. They're from Littleton, Massachusetts. I got the easy ones now, Connor. Yeah. It's when I joined, it's all easy. Yeah. So, you know, the way we planned it. Uh, but this team does have two district wins, by the way. 28, 31, and 1. Two district wins. That's got to be worth something, right? Uh, so winners at the Western uh, New England District and the Central Mass District uh, did not make the playoffs in their first event, though, at Granite State. So uh, interesting to see how that will work out. Um, also played at the uh, uh, Tesla Division, um, where they were not selected, and also played at Mayhem and Merrimack. Were there playoffs at Mayhem and Merrimack? Yes, uh, we did a round robin uh, that just okay. hasn't been uploaded to TVA yet. I'm working on that right now. Nope, that makes sense. Uh, the only team that didn't make it to a limbs at Mayhem was 166 because it's our host event, and we graciously backed out. No, that's cool. To dude. form six perfect alliances. Uh, by the way, uh, uh, Cecilia's 1073, um, or C scales, because I always say that wrong, uh, says 6320 has a surprise for Battle Cry, but not sure what. Uh, but sold for $21 uh, to PNW Room Enthusiasts, who has apparently now paid triple more than any other team they had before. Uh, by taking that one for the amount of money they did. All right, next team coming up is 40, 48, 40, 48. That's Redshift from Westboro, Massachusetts. And coming up in two seconds here, this team, 1625 and 0. As a member of the New England District, they ranked 138th, having earned 36 points. How many teams are in the New England District? At least. I think I think it says 210, but it's actually like 203. I think. Okay, it's over I 200. It was 216. Oh. Maybe I don't know. I think last I checked with the rankings, it was 216 ranking. Well, no, I see 210, and like six teams did not play. Interesting, but in that period of time, the kidlets come in and snipe their third team for nine dollars. Kidlets takes that with a lot of money left over still. Uh, 29th is going to be 5421. 5421. That's the Birchbots from New York. New York. From New York, New York, the Birchbots. Bidding is open. Uh, 5 4 and 0. Oh, only played at the New York City Regional this year and did not make the playoffs. But who are enthusiasts with their trademarked bid of $8 takes them. And we'll see how they do at uh, this weekend on Battlecry. Luke, you're just ranking up these New York teams, huh? Oh, yeah. New York's the best region in the world. Nobody them. knows them outside of their region, right? So. In New, New York, York is the best district. Mm. Uh, it's Luke, the it's, we can all agree area. it's the most expensive district. Yeah. Agreed. Right next to California. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, north or south, though. Hey, Luke, can you just do me a favor? What's up? Just DM that to Danny real fast, thing. Eh? Of course. Uh, C-Scales, by the way, says 203 New England teams uh, and posted a link in chat. Uh, next team coming up, 172 Northern Force. They're from... Uh, oh, man. See if I can get this one here, Connor. <laughs> uh, Falmouth, Gorham, Maine. Falmouth, Gorham. Uh, okay, Gorham I would not have gotten, but Falmouth I almost I almost went with. Uh, and bidding's open for $8. Uh, 39 31 and 0 above 500 this year. 
uh, quarterfinalists at the Southeast Mass event, at the Central Mass event, quarterfinalists, and at Pine Tree, semifinalists, district championships, quarterfinalists. Looks like they might have came in as a backup potentially, though. They did. Okay. Uh, and then in the Daily Division, uh, quarterfinalists as well. So you got a team that uh, in playoffs at uh, championships. That's why I see them right now commanding $26 from the Quran Fan Club, up to 30 Dollars, be the most expensive one for over enthusiasts if they go with it. Uh, Record Plant says 172 is slow but consistent. <laughs> and sold Karan Fan Club taking it for 31 dollars. That leaves them 130 left. And that's their fourth team. <laughs> Here's a pretty well uh, household name team that's been around many times. Uh, this year uh, had a 500 record. I think a couple of years ago is when they uh, shined out a bit, but still a great team. That's team number 1058, the PVC Pirates. 1058 coming up uh, for bidding, and they're from uh, Londonderry, New Hampshire. Or is it Londonderry? Londonderry, you said it right. right. Uh, got a blue banner this year with a Chairman's Award at the UNH District. Uh, Southern New Hampshire event out in the quarters. Uh, at UNH, out in semis. That was a mistake. And it's gone. Yeah. All right. Was it? <laughs> uh, $13, $14. Yeah, if you see that, say it right away so I can catch that. Uh, and then at the New England District Championships, did not play in the playoffs. Darwin Division did not play in the playoffs. $16. And up to seventeen eighteen. Uh, C scales uh, says uh, that they can do all levels of the climb one and two and one, two, three. Nineteen dollars now, twenty. <clears throat> Up to twenty one dollars. We're over halfway through, by the way. So we're going going decently quick here in time and sold for twenty one dollars to well known. Outside of the region, that's her 14. How many teams have been drafted so far? Uh, we are on team number 32 now. So we're heading into 32. Uh, and that is going to be team number 1991. That's the Dragons from Hartford, Connecticut. Uh, thanks for the bits, by the way. Uh, slow, low, uh, blah, blah, slow, low, flow on. Thank you. Yeah, don't forget, guys, beginning of the month, we'd love to have your Twitch Prime subscriptions. I know it's the off-season stuff, but if you got that credit, we'd love to help you help or have us uh, have you help us uh, support live, live and independent content uh, here on FUN. Uh, so if you got a Twitch Prime subscription, love it. Always just a few bucks a month to get some exclusive emotes to use in chat, which you can also use in all the off-season events on the Blue Alliance as well, too, as uh, we uh, share chat rooms uh, with them. Um, as well, and sold for nine dollars to the Kitlets, who picks up now team number four, but still one hundred forty-seven bucks left. Your car. Haha, <laughs> because <laughs> uh -huh, it's a dragon. Uh, next. I see. I I can still catch on with you know what the the youth is these days. Olazol, thank you for that prime sub, by the way. Uh, next team coming up, seventeen twenty-one title force. From Concord, New Hampshire. Or is it Concord? It's Concord. Concord? Concord. Okay. Like Concord, like I overtook somebody. Yeah. Interesting. Not, not Concord as in like the plane. <clears throat> yeah, that's, yeah, that's interesting. Yeah. All right. Uh, yeah, thanks again, Olazola5818 for that uh, sub. Welcome back. Uh, 1624 and O and sold for $9.00. The Kron Fan Club, who picks up team number five with $121 left. We'll just keep on moving. 4564 is your next team. 4564 Orange Chaos coming up. Orange Chaos is from Brewer, Maine. Guessing I got that right. Yeah. Uh, 17, 13, and 0 this year. Played at Granite State for their quarter finalist, Pine Tree. So they're semi-finalists and up to 10 bucks. I didn't notice this in the bids, by the way. It does have uh, up to the uh, thousandth of a second in case there's a weird time. Things. 
Sixteen dollars. Yeah, what do you guys think about uh, forty-five sixty-four? By the way, Orange Chaos, very cool. Says Bill B, strong team. Commanding nineteen dollars. And sold for nineteen dollars. Grand Fan Club now starting to rack up the teams here. Picks up team number six in the draft for them. All right, here's a team. Your first two numbers start with 27. You might have been waiting for a long time. It's team number 27. Well, 13. 27, 13. I Raiders. Who hasn't been waiting for this team? Coming out of Melrose, <laughs> Massachusetts. Got you baited. I was rude. Uh, <laughs> with a record of 11, 28, and 0. 11, 28, and 0 uh, this year. I. Uh, Made it to the finals as a backup team at the New England District Rhode Island event, but did play in three matches of the finals. And that's their only playoff appearance. Favorite team starts with 27. That was it. $7 sold to uh, TCG. That's only your second team. Jeez. All that money. All right, low number team coming up here. That's team number 138. 138 Entropy from Amherst, New Hampshire. Entropy, 15, 14, and 0 played at the Southern uh, uh, New Hampshire event where they were quarterfinalists. Central Mass where they were quarterfinalists, and that's their two events. $9 to the Kidlets. 10 already. So we're on team number 36, by the way, of 57, right? Yep. And by the way, if you do draft these teams, make sure you contact them to make sure they're going to uh, show up and encourage them to do so, so you don't lose a team. Uh, with that said, sold uh, there, and uh, went to the Kidlets, right? Yep, went to the Kidlets there, team number 138. It was a chaotic decision. Very Uh, next team coming up, I command a few dollars here. That's team number two, 228, Gus Robotics. 228, Gus Robotics. 29, 28, and 0 oh, in official play this year. Quarterfinalists at Waterbury at Western New England event. They were semifinalists at Hartford. Quarterfinalists, New England District Championship. Not in the playoffs. $10. Seven point five second stream delay. Yeah, we don't have it on. Uh, uh, we don't have it on the quick mode right now because I don't want people to buffer. So, two seconds, one, and sold for fifteen dollars to well known outside our region who picks up team number five with seventy eight dollars left. All right, get out your checkbooks, everybody. If you know what those are because I'm old, and we still use those back then. It's team number 2791, Shaker Robotics. 2791. Coming out of Latham. Is it Latham? Latham? It's Latham. Latham. Oh, all right. They're not from New England, I wouldn't know. <laughs> Latham, New York. Thank you very much, by the way. Yeah, clearly I don't know who they are, right? $63 immediately. Oh, I thought they were going to go. $64. Uh, two regional wins this year, New York Tech Valley and the Central New York Regional. Uh, as pointed out, in Chief Delphi, the number one pick, but out in the semifinals in the Darwin Division, $65. That was kind of tragic. <clears throat> Based on uh, their alliance, or? I'm sure you could get a lot of answers from this chat. Probably. <laughs> But still a good year for uh, Shaker Box, no doubt. Uh, definitely looked very strong in their two regionals. A long break, though, between uh, their uh, regional. The last time they played was week three before championships. Karan did very well at driving. So, I mean, we could argue about that, like, he's probably, after that, the best active driver in FRC, maybe. Uh, yes. So, props to Karan for that. Props to Karan. Karan, you should get a trophy for that. It's like he has a fan club. <laughs> That's true. Uh, it's sold for seventy dollars. Kid, let's takes it. Look at all that distraction that Tegan's doing talking, and she takes it for seventy bucks there. 
Hey, yeah. take it. Next yes. Game. Welcome to the Double Digits Club. Thank you. I would say I won an award, but instead I just won the draft. <laughs> there you Holy go. Sure. Uh, we're gonna keep it's moving on. Our time to throw on purpose. Our next team coming in from Manchester, New Hampshire, team number one and thirty-one, Chaos. Which apparently stands for Central High and our sponsors. Okay. Uh thirteen, sixteen, and one in official play this year. What do you guys think uh, on the price paid for uh Shaker? Uh Bilby says twenty seven ninety one strong, but not as strong as cracked up to be. Capital D colon. Uh, Eleven dollars there. Twelve dollars for well known. And don't forget these amounts that are going to be set. Uh, you and the audience, and of course everybody else, will have an opportunity to pick uh, teams based on the values that they paid for. So, if you think uh, that a team was overrated or underrated, well, you get to assemble your own team. You get a chance to win an Amazon gift card as well too. After this, uh, and I don't know if everybody saw, but uh, whatever the captain is of our live draft team will also get a gift card. Uh, for the winners as well. Uh, Cran Fan Club takes it. $16 for team number 131. Nice. All right, next Welcome, Ryan. We've been expecting you. <laughs> Hello. Uh, next team, big fan of the Princess Bride there. It's Team Inconceivable, 1729. Out of Peterborough, New Hampshire. Oh, I got that right? All right. Yeah. Yeah, uh, I mean it does look how it sounds, but yeah, sounds how it looks. Strike that, reverse it. I really want for that. Uh, Thirteen dollars. Uh, this team here, forty, thirty-five, and one. <laughs> and somebody, somebody did point out we uh, the couple big teams that have still not gone yet. Of course, uh, uh, we had uh, six ninety-four still up in the gate, one ninety-five still to come up. Uh, are the outliers in this event? Yeah, they're still yeah. out. Okay. Yep. And aluminum falcons as well too. A few others as well. So up to thirty dollars for Team Inconceivable. Team was semi finalists. Well that was week zero, so it's a district state event, quarter finalists, Southern New Hampshire event. Uh went to the finals in four. I also won yeah. the entering inspiration award. <clears throat> Pine Tree quarter finalist, New England District Championship, did not play in the playoffs and daily division in the semifinals. Uh and sold for thirty two bucks. So right now, uh, Tennis Court Gang, $184 left. Uh, some of those big names coming up. we be very interested to see uh, how they go and who gets taken where. Uh, but how about our next team coming up? Our second rookie team. It's going to be team number 7462, Disruptive Technologies. They're out of Danbury, Connecticut, with a record of 11-23-0. and 11-23-0. Uh, Aaron uh, says, uh, I want to see 195 do defense with their Neo power. <laughs> we did an interview with the team this year that did, uh, man, what team was it? They used Sims and Neos, which I thought was interesting on their drive. $9. I think. Yes, that sounds right. Yep. Uh, Robo Tigers, right? Yeah. Uh, 7462 sells for nine dollars. Nine dollars going to uh, PNW Over Enthusiast, who now has all the high number teams uh, in the draft. You have you have every single you have the first what one two three four five six, <laughs> seven teams are you have the highest seven numbers and one has not been picked yet. So <laughs> gambling there. I'm telling you, man. High numbers is the high scoring team. Yes. Love to see your pick list at championships. Uh, next team coming up, 33-23, potential energy. Do they have the potential to have a big impact here? Well, their official record was 10-18. and 18, So let's see how much money they're going to go for here in the draft. 10-18 and 18 for potential energy out of Litchfield, New Hampshire. And uh, Southern uh, New Hampshire event. Uh, out in the semifinals, Central Mass did not play in the playoffs. And sold for $7 to the Tennis Court Gang. Takes a nice uh, low-value team for their draft. Next one coming up, 1474 Titans. 
That's 1474. Man, all right, Connor, I might need your help on this one. Yes, Tewksbury. 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 All right. Uh, Tewksbury, like, Massachusetts. Like I, like I took something. Yeah. Uh, Tewksbury, Massachusetts. 27, 13, and 1. Not a bad record at all. Uh, at the, let's see, North Shore event out in the quarters. Greater Boston event out in the quarters. Uh, DCMP did not play uh, in the elimination event. So they missed. So they were ranked three in Greater Boston. They had to be ranked in the other one. Ranked two. So they do well in yeah. they do well in quals, just not elims apparently. They they got unlucky. Very. <clears throat> well, if that's true. Then Luke got a hell of a steal with ten dollars. Mm -hmm. So nicely done there. All right, we're gonna do one more, then take a quick break, and then we have our final teams coming up. So we just did the Titans, correct? Yep. So our actually we're gonna do two more. So sorry. Uh, so our forty fourth team out of fifty seven is gonna be forty one seventy six Iron Tigers forty one seventy six, and they're coming up here. They're from uh, Northeastern Massachusetts. Yeah, let's learn more about this team. 920 and 0. 920 and 0. A quarter finalists. Southeast Mass event. And at the Rhode Island event, quarter finalists as well. And they sell for $8 to the tennis court gang. All right, last team before we take a short break here. And that's going to be team number 2084. 2084. Robots by the sea. I get it. Ha ha. From Manchester, is it? Oh, because it's Manchester by the sea. I'm like, wait, Manchester's not by the sea. All right. Um, so Manchester by the sea, or sorry, Robots by the sea. 14-17-0 in official play this year. They played at Granite State where they're out in the semifinals and also the North Shore event out in the quarterfinals and sold for $8 to p and w, w over Enthusiast. All right, so we have some really big teams left to go, right? We're going to be on 46 through 57. Let's do a check-in. Man, I'm going to take a deep breath for this. P&W Over Enthusiast has, there we go, 166, 1071, 1474, 1735, 2084, 54, 21, 59, 43, 63, 28, 64, 01, 71, 27, 71, 53, 74, 07, 74, 62 with $36. Luke, holy crap. Honestly, I'm feeling pretty good. I've got... I think the most teams by a pretty significant chunk, and most of them aren't awful teams. Um, they generally look pretty solid, so I'm feeling pretty. Yeah, I mean, the, it can be as you mentioned before. It can be a very viable strategy to go with. Uh, the lunch company, twenty six dollars left with one seventy five, ten seventy three, eleven hundred twenty eight seventy seven, thirty four sixty one, thirty four sixty seven, forty ninety seven, and forty nine oh nine. Twenty six bucks left. Who are you hoping to get here? Um, I am trying to see if I can get 126, but I also see tennis, tennis court strategy, so let's see how that how it plays out. All right, Kidlet, 65 bucks left. Uh, Tegan, you got 138, 181, 1991, 27, 12, 27, 91, and 40, 48. Congratulations, you can read. Good job. Uh, I know, we're just, we're just doing the thing, and we'll, uh, We'll keep doing the Tegan, sounds like she's pulling a Dean Kamen there, but we'll let her pass on that. Uh, Karen Fan Club has uh, team number 121, 131, 172, 467, 1721, 1729, 4564, and 5813. $54 left for you. How's your team looking? Uh, we thought 1729 was a pretty good steal. We, we had some pretty good value picks, so. Uh, JHT seems to agree with you in chat, uh, by the way, as well. Uh, well known outside our region, seventy eight dollars left. You got uh, five teams: one ninety, two twenty eight, ten fifty eight, thirty seven nineteen, and forty forty one. Yeah, um, we're looking for a six powerhouse team, possibly a seventh. We'll see what happens. Um, yeah. Well, that's going to be up to uh, probably the tennis court game with one hundred and sixty nine dollars left. Uh, four teams though: one fifty seven, twenty seven, thirteen, thirty three, twenty three, and forty one seventy six. Uh, tennis court gang, you just going to go all out these last few picks? Yeah, Jack, we won't let you pick them. Sorry. <laughs> that was still 50 30 from us. Nah, we're going to go at least 80 on them. Dang it. We need your help to keep fun loud, live, and independent. Help us by visiting our Patreon to pledge your support at patreon.com forward slash first updates now. 
You can also support fun live on Twitch for a few bucks a month or by linking your Prime account for free and clicking subscribe. Thank you to all of our co-executive producers keeping fun loud, live, and independent.